everybody, it's Matt Merton from mattmerton.com and I'm coming to you from what was once my man cave and now is the kid cave. But uh, this week's tip, ooh, happy Halloween by the way. This week's tip for fixing up your home and increasing your resale value is installing a laminate floor. And the reason I'm down in the basement is because we had a horrible concrete floor down here uh, with some bad Berber carpet over it. It took me about seven hours, but I put in a new laminate floor and take a look right here. See, we started by laying out the underlayment, which is a moisture barrier to protect the floor. Then you lay it in in steps. You actually don't do a straight row first, you just do it piece by piece, sort of building a step formation across the room. It's important to use a rubber mallet and a tamper to get it tight. You want to make sure all the seams are tight because this floor really its rigidity comes from its interlocking ability. Mortise around all the parts of the room such as the poles in the middle or even the corners where the cabinetry is. You want to also make sure the pattern stays random so use pieces from different boxes so you have light and dark woods put together. And there you have it. Then you just have to add some shoe mold and quarter round and you are done. Make yourself a nice bright floor for any living space. Works especially well in a basement. It looks just like wood. It's about eight millimeters thick. So it's about the thickness of an engineered hardwood floor. Uh, 20 year lifespan on it. It doesn't scratch from all the kids toys, tennis shoes and dog nails and all what have you. So like I said, it took about seven hours. Cost right under $800 to put the whole thing in, but it definitely makes this room more of a living space. So that's the tip for this week. Have a happy Halloween, and I'll talk to you soon. Check out my website, mattmerton.com. Bye-bye.